And we're back for more Souls of the Forest. Hello, everyone. This is Souls of the Forest of Fire Emblem Rom Hack by Scryza. I'm your host, Pondon, and we're about to just get a quick heads up. Raquel is the commander, but Beryl is who can seize. I intend to let both be able to seize in a later release. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's like TLP. Hello, Beryl. Good morning. Ah, Raquel, morning. Say, uh, I've heard a little commotion in the camp. You know of it, right? Oh, it was no problem. It was merchants that passed by and saw us. They offered us their trading services. We'll be able to get items on demand now. Ah, I see. That's good, then. Can we afford that, though? Well, we haven't much in the way of cash now, for sure. But that was probably the change once we get, once we take the bandits' fort. I believe they ought to store some of their findings in there. Hmm, makes sense. We also need someone for the convoy to stay with, for us to keep whatever it is that we find in the fort. I believe you'd be the best candidate for that, Beryl. Me? Why? Because you don't have a horse. Well, you're already behind the front line of battle. You and the convoy would share locations in battle. This way, it's neither far nor unguarded from us. There'll be less trouble to you than they're worth, I promise. Well, I can imagine us holding on to everything we find ourselves. Sure, no problem. Good, glad we can count on you, Beryl. Pretty interesting explanation for why the Lord has a big pocket. Gotta love big pocket lords. Whew, I was afraid I'd be the one carrying everything. Morning greets us with the great gentlest of breezes. Quite calming, eh, Brent? It almost makes me feel as if yesterday wasn't real, indeed. I feel as if this breeze blow away any of my worries. Yeah, I feel the same. It's good if we can relax, even if you're going through all that. Well, of course we can, Royal. It was fired for our homeland, but we're still people. Nobody will think less of us for admiring the beauty of our land. The gentle wind traveling across the ash-stained land. The soft and gray could mistake the clouds from heaven. Ma, you sure like it here, huh? I give my life for our land and our people. Dude is... Dude is... He's like... He's like a Camus, but he's on your side. Something on your mind, Royal? Now that it gives thought to what you just told me. In a way, we're giving our people the relief that this breeze gives us. <laughs> That's a way to see it, I suppose. No one can help others like this. I feel like I'm full of energy again. Just the feeling of safety we can give our people. It's wonderful. Hmm. You know, I had my doubts about you fighting with us before. What? Really? Yes, I thought you might be too young, but after hearing you, I've lost all my doubts. You should be here with us. You have the heart of a true knight of Troria. Trura. I don't know. Whoa, uh, that's a lot of praise. I'm just speaking my mind. With all of us working as a team, I have little doubts. We will earn our knighthood, I am sure of it. Well, may it be as you say, Brent. We can't celebrate yet, though. Yes, we still have a long road ahead of us. Raquel? Did mean to interrupt your hearty chatter. Oh no, it's alright. We're just nearly done with it anyway. Well, if you have nothing more to say to each other, then prepare to ride onward. It'd be unwise to give the bandits more time to rest. Understood, we'll get ready. Ooh. This palette makes an appearance again, looking nice. Look at this camera stuff, too. The bandits have carried themselves quite the place, haven't they? This fort is quite ruined. Some walls are weak, but it seems very much hospitable for a group. Yeah, the wear is visible. The volcano near here wasn't kind to the fort. I'd expect it to be worse, honestly. Did the bandits really fix the place to make it their hideout? We've got a bit of a clever bunch to fight against in that case. Buildings once, secure our, one, buildings once used to secure our land are now being used to threaten us. A bit of a twist, isn't it? Very much so. So this is it then, another brawl? Yes, I'll get all of us ready in formation to attack. We can prepare for them. We won't get ambushed again. Hey, boss. It's music. Man, this is like, this reminds me of like spooky, like Super Mario World, like donut house or like ghost house music. What is it? Is Grohl's back in here yet? Nah, boss. I should have come with a good haul by now. <laughs> this don't look good to me. You. Time to earn your cut. You got any clue what happened to him? Something must have fought them back. You lot aren't exactly the patient type. I warned you against getting noticed. For all we know, there could be mercenaries hired to seek after our head now. Tisk, very helpful, bookworm. Hope he's that spell better than your head. Get everyone up to ready and go searching. That fool better not be running away with the loot. Or have it your way. I won't need you after I get his might. Well, they're already noticing something's off. Yes, they are. Let's get ready quickly. Oh, we get battle preps in chapter two. Well, let's see this lunatic gem. Does absolutely nothing. Proof that you're playing lunatic mode. Good luck. Aha, my screenshots will be super legit now. Uh, we get some talks to do. We get, oh, we can do supports too. Supports for Kel. That's nifty. He supports only the bow dude. That's funny. Amy and Brent. That's nice. Amy and Ron. Oh, so the, all the cabs support each other. That's pretty nifty. Pretty nifty. All right. Let's see, items, do I get anything interesting in my supply? No. Ooh, 
Scryz, you gotta tell me how you get this uh, 200 supply convoy. That's pretty nifty. I like that. Okay. We got two bosses here. We got Baguette. Raider in charge of the Raiders. <laughs> Located in an abandoned fort. Pretty straightforward. He's buff. And then we got this guy over here. Raider the Shaman. Drops a heal staff. That's pretty nice. Got Lunatome. Pierce's resistance cannot critical. That's cool. Alright, so... I gotta seize the throne. Do these guys have anything? I'm assuming these guys are packing heat. Iron Axe. Nothing too crazy. Oh, a Devil Axe! Chapter 2 Devil Axe! Your blood of the enemies roll the dice. Holy heck, look at the stats on this thing. Oh man, this is gonna be fun. This will be real, real fun to use. I cannot wait to use this Devil Axe. I'm just gonna let it sit on this so YouTube picks it up as the thumbnail. But that's uh, that's really wild. Alright, so we got some stuff here. Some chest items. Alright, we should be in... feel pretty good about this. Alright, so thinking what the strat's gonna be. I feel like I just need to go in. Because these are really the <coughs> only dudes that can attack me this turn. And I feel like I'd rather deal with this guy on the back end. Although I don't know if... Hmm. Cause, wait, hang on. Uh. Hang on. Uh. Alright, let's see. Yeah, because if I... this Because these guys... Yeah. Alright. Alright, I think I know what I'm going to do. We'll try this out. I'm going to try really hard not to die. Raquel, some walls look like they're about to crumble. The building certainly is weary. Looks unsafe to me. We could try and break down some walls to make a pass. Would save us some time and catch the bandits off guard. Wait, are you serious? Won't the whole building come down or something? I doubt so. Those aren't pillars. Besides, if it does, the bandits are the ones getting buried. That's a way to look at things. It seems quite efficient, at least, being quick or getting rid of them. Neither of those outcomes seem like a loss to me. Alright, cool. So, I like the little like gameplay flavor text that this game does. I think that's pretty nifty. Alright, let's see. Twelve. Eighteen, that is. Thirty precisely, that's not enough. Okay, I could use Raquel here. This guy can take the forest, but he can Okay. I think I know what I'm going to do. We're going to use Raquel here. Ooh, look at the sprite for Raquel. Nice little edits that you've made, Skryza. I assume these are you. Um, the edits that you've made. And then a little, little barrel kill. All right. There we go. All right, then... I think the play actually might be... Yeah, because I don't want all these axe dudes charging in on me right in that spot. And I don't think Brent can take on both of these dudes. Well, he only takes one damage. Okay, that's pretty chill. Alright, so let's just do this instead. Do some talking. Royal, hey. Huh, O'Barrel, what is it? Thanks for your help yesterday. We'd have gotten ourselves overwhelmed if you weren't there. Oh, it was nothing. I'm honestly surprised we're still alive. There were so many. How did we defeat them? But we've got Raquel to thank for that. She got both of us out of that on harm. Hmm, that she did. Quite happy that she's the one that leads us all. Me too. Honestly, I just know how to shoot a boat, not tactics. She's only being outnumbered well enough, if you ask me. Well, she knows more than we do in that regard. Doubt she'll be a Valkyrie if she didn't know her stuff. Well, she's proven it to me for sure. Wherever she goes, I'll follow. Same here, Beryl. Yeah. Respect. Alright, and then Annie's gonna go over here right out of range. Let's see how this goes. First turn. Did I fuck up? Maybe I did. Let's find out. Alright. There we go. Look at that weapon triangle. What do you know about the weapon triangle? I know a shit ton about it now. Let's go. Ooh, he's going in close. Okay, this is fine. And that could be a kill, probably for Amy, I'm guessing. Alright, now I gotta... 
They're charging me, man. These guys are charging me. All right. All right. I might just leave Barrel here. Um, what are you doing against these guys? Oof, this, oh, this is the Devil Axe, dude. Okay, he's got to go. Yeah, let's do this. Nice crit. First Divine Use. That's fine. I got the Devil Axe now, though. Okay, we'll let Brent do this. Nice. These hit rates are all really good. I kind of like when the hit rates are this good, honestly. It makes things just feel a little bit more assured and you can't rely on dodging as much. It's like I'm looking forward to getting an Armor Knight. If the game will give me an Armor Knight. Let's see. Double HP, look at there. There you go, Barrel. That was a nice level up. How do you do here? You do pretty well, actually. Okay, so... Then are you in range of this guy? And you're in range of this guy, then. Actually, one, two, three, four. Wait, right, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think that should be fine. Let's try this out. Little this guy down. Take a little bit of a hit there, but that's fine. Oh no, that wasn't fine. That was not fine. Uh oh, uh oh. Let's see. Does this guy have a hand axe too? No, he's one, two, three, four, five. All right, so I only take from the bow guy who does 20. And Royal has five, six, so if I kill this guy, then Royal lives. All right, all right, all right. This is not as bad as I thought it was going to be, but I need to heal next turn. Uh, the triangle. If only I had the triangle here. All right. I like these custom icons, too, I gotta say. All right, let's see. Ooh, yes. Level ups. All right, 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 all right. Man, okay, I can't even get into the fort here. Um, let's see. All right, so I'm thinking steel arc, steel bow, okay. Royal's got to get up in here. This guy does 18. 13, 13. Okay, that's a kill. And then... Should be able to double this guy, yeah. Alright, so I'm thinking... Yeah, we'll have Barrel go here. And he's gonna do this. I'm gonna have Royal go up and take care of the rest of this guy. I'm trying to minimize the amount of damage I take on this turn because I only have a single heal left. And then this guy's coming in. I want to make sure that Annie's in position to take a hit from that guy on this next turn. But I think she's the only one that can take, besides Raquel, of course, the only one that can take a hit from both the Axe and the Lance dude here. So we're going to try this out. Let's see what Royal gets. Better level up this time. Much better. Much, much better. All right. Chest key. All right, so this guy's got one. This guy steal it. So this is one, two, three, four, five. So here is good. Okay, now... Alright, so I think the play will be... Let's do this with Brent. Yeah, let's get Brent in here. I'll have Annie finish him off. Heal with Raquel and then put her in position. Let's see, okay. Thankfully, there's no funky skills for me to worry about getting, like, counter-killed or something silly like that. All right, now... Now, what about you? You've got a hand axe, which is fine, because you're doing 25, and you're doing 18. Um, 
Mm, yeah, I want to go here. Because now I can do this. Do some strats here, boys. Okay, we'll do a little trades these here. Okay, so I want... Let's see. Now I'm fine with her taking the hit there because she has a better chance to dodge the triangle and will take less damage. So if they want to go for her, that's fine. Talk. Hey, Raquel. Amy, what is it? Just wondering, what do you think of these those fighting with us? I think they're capable and strong young soldiers, yourself included, Annie. Thank you. Yet. Yes. I don't doubt their strength. Just asking what you think of them as people, you know? That's quite a strange question to ask me. I mean, we're both girls. What do you think of the men around here? I'm not sure myself. They all seem nice, but that's an even stranger question to ask me. I'm not interested in that. And even if I were, they're too young for me. Huh? I mean, I understand Beryl being young, but how old are you even? Now that's a question you should not be asking me. Let us room the fight with the bandit, shall we? What? But come on, don't leave me hanging, please. Move out or use the seal staff to hit you. Okay, I get it. My, that tongue is going to get you into trouble someday, Annie. All right, let's see. Mend it up. 31, that takes her right up to full. And then I'll go here. Actually, if I go here, yeah, then Royal safe. All right, let's try this. Oh, maybe that was a bad idea. That was probably a bad idea. That was probably a really bad idea. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no, the longbow. Oh, I forgot about this shit. Ah. Uh, no. All right. That's frustrating. I got aggressive. I got too aggressive. I didn't respect the game. Right, let's try this again. So the first couple turns were fine, and then I just got a little too aggressive there. We're going to keep this going. I'm going to turn the animations off just to get back up to speed. I don't mind dying if like, I die pretty early and like the chapters aren't too long. If I die late in the chapter, I'm going to be annoyed. <laughs> but let's see here. And then... I forgot how I position the rest of these dudes, so... Brent will go here. Okay, I think this is what I did. Okay. I'm not crazy about these enemies charging at you. It kind of makes sense. Rather than, like... I kind of like... In a way, I like that they take the fight to you. But at the same time, it's also like you kind of just get holed up playing defensively, just trying to move forward a little bit. It's a bit different than what I would say I'm used to, and that's maybe just like my own bias coming through. But what I worry about is that like the map will basically clear out and then I'll just be walking to the boss. But we'll see how it actually plays out. I'm sure Scryza has some stuff in store for us. Let's see. Okay, so we'll do this again. Hmm. I'll get you on the forest here. Amy can do this. Okay. Okay, yeah, I used Raquel here. Just to get rid of this guy. Devil Axe. Okay, then... No, let's see. Cause I don't think, yeah, there's not enough move. I should have should have put him up one. What does this guy have? He's just got. Is this the hand axe? Yeah. So he's gonna. I don't want to let him get take a forest. Talk here. We didn't do this talk last time. Hey, Brent. Royal, what do you need? Need to thank you. That would be up live after what went on yesterday. The bandit attack? It was nothing. It's part of my duty as a future knight. Besides, it's not like you to handle yourself badly. You handle yourself well, better than the usual raw recruit. Huh, really? I was too busy not to die to notice. The brave tame their fear, Royal. Fear is never forgotten for someone who had a first real fight, though so you managed well. You will learn how to strike fear on our enemies eventually. For now you have to make with striking with your sword. Hmm? Well, I'll do my best to keep up with you. Onwards, then. Onwards. All right, let's try this out. 
Nice. Okay, that's fine. Okay, now this archer moves in. Yeah, you really need to... I really need to just, like, relearn how to play Fire Emblem with this game. Alright, so let's see here. Let's see... Yeah, so if I remember correctly... I want to use I'll use barrel and royal. Okay, so I don't want to get rid of the steel. The steel axe guy is probably the scariest one to take a hit from, but I think I'm just going to the archer too is just really annoying. Twenty damage. Mm. Panicking, panicking here. All right, let's see. Let's just attack this guy. Yeah, I... Dodge it? No. And then... Let's go... No, because I want to choke this hole up. So we'll do that. Do this. Okay. Not as good as the last one, but that's still fine. How much damage do you take here? 15 and 23. So 15 and 13. You'll live, so we can kill this guy. Chest key. Send this back. Because then we can do a little Brent. 14. All right, that's enough. So let's open this up with Brent. Okay. So this guy has only got a steel lance. Yeah, so he can't reach Raquel from that spot. But if I go here, okay, do this. Let's see what happens. What the heck, man? This damage output. Does this guy have a hand axe? Yes, he does. Heck! Heck, 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 heck. All right. Man, oh man, oh man, oh man. I want to get this right, guys. I'm hell-bent on beating this game. This is so frustrating, though, I have to say. But I just feel like it's my own fault. It's my own dang fault for playing the way I play. But I just don't... The problem is, is like, I want to go faster. I just really want to go faster. But I also want to make sure I give all my dudes enough experience here. Um, let's see. Try Divine Strats over here instead. Um, oh, we didn't do this talk last time. Hey, Beryl. Amy, what is it? Oh, nothing. Just checking you. Just to be sure you're fine. I'm fine enough. Thanks for asking. You sure? Not a bit scared or anything? Oh, uh, no, not really. You know, you've been hiding it pretty well for a recruit. It's fine to be afraid, really, so long as enemies don't see it. I realize, though, you know? Nothing wrong with talking about to us what bothers you. Well, it's a bit embarrassing. Besides, this is a battlefield. Wouldn't it be best later? Yeah, it's true. But whenever we can, just talk about what's on your mind. None of us will judge, promise. Are you sure you wouldn't mind? Not at all. If it does good, why not? We're almost going to lie very often, and that takes its toll on you. You had your first taste of combat. It's fine to be uncertain. Or afraid. We're here. We're with you on and off the battle. And you're with us, don't forget that. We'll keep that in mind, though. Thanks, Amy. A smile, now that's what I like to see. Oh, that's cute. Cute little convo. All right. I really want to get to that point. Let's see. Changing things up a little bit here. Okay, this guy goes for Brent now. That's fine, too. I like Raquel not having any damage here. Which I think might be a little bit more essential. So let's see. So... I think I might do a bit of this. 
and give this one to Royale. No, he can't do it, So, but Brent can. Okay, then Amy comes here. And then... Yeah, blocking Brent off. And then your toast. Yeah, you really, I just need to use Raquel more. I think that's kind of just the strat here. Just use Raquel. Use your Jagan. I have a good, powerful Jagan. But she's soft. I gotta be careful. 18. Let's see. And now he's in a better position to peel back, too, which is nice. Alright. Okay, let's see what happens here. Goes for Brent, not surprisingly. Okay, that's fine. This is all fine. This is fine, this is fine, this is fine. All right, all right, all right. 12, not enough, all right. Can you do this here? Yes. Get this guy out of here, all right. You really have to make good use of your player phases here. All right, so then let's... I'm a little worried that I won't be able to Let's see. I'm just gonna kill these guys off. Chest key. I'm gonna have to just go for this. Ooh, the damage. But at least now Amy can just swoop in, snag this one. And then I'll heal Brent. Let's see how this goes. These other guys need to heal real bad. Let's see. Amy might not die here, let's hope. Oh wait, this is the same... I did the exact same thing I did last time. Oh, but she dodged. All right. RNG, RNG proof strats, everyone. All right. All right. Okay. Oh, man. This is definitely making me sweat a little bit. I really got to work for this. All right. So, Pharaoh with a nice kill. Come on. Some stats. Those are some stats. There we go. Because you can attack me. No, if I don't go past the stairs, then you're good. These guys, Iron Axe, Hand Axe, Hand Axe, Hand Axe. So, how much damage do these Hand Axe dudes do? Seven. Let's see, 18, 18, 18. Okay, so as long as he has more than 20 HP, he survives. All right. Get rid of this guy. Oh, wait, I probably should have healed up. Restores 20 HP. That brings you up to full, my friend, so we're going to do that. Okay, and then you... We'll put you down here with the Hand Axe and heal up. Just in case these guys want to try the wraparound strats. Okay. And then... Put you there. Let's see what happens. Dodge it. Nice. They're all going for him. This is fine. My sword cab dodge tank strats. All right. That worked out surprisingly well. But the boss is moving in on us hard now. All right. We got to clear these guys out quickly. All right. Beryl needs to heal this turn. Um, let's see. How do you do here? Close, but not enough. And then... Luna. All right, all right, all right. So let's see here. That'll... Vulnerary heals him up to full. Let's try... 
And then how do you do here? Let's just do this. Keep attacking, Barrel. Keep attacking. Chest key. Okay, he's out of range here. I can pull Raquel back to where I need her to be. Excellent. Getting some nice RNG right now. And then we'll just uh, trade this. All right, let's see how this goes. If it goes for her, that's fine. She gets a level out of it. Let's see what it is. Solid. All right. All right, now we got the boss to deal with. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. How are you saying? What are you saying here? Fives? That's it? Can we get better close range? No. But I got to watch out for this dude over here and then this dude. All right, so how do you do? Just enough to one around the boss, which is pretty nifty. That's convenient. Let's see. We gotta get rid of this guy first. So let's do barrel. A barrel can just one around this dude, which is pretty nice. Um, I gotta be careful with where I put barrel here. Um, I want to give this boss experience to someone else besides Raquel, but I guess she's probably gonna need it. So let's just do this. Uh, I'm using divine a little bit too much. But it's the boss, so. Um, but first, let's let's take care of this guy. And you you could also do this, but then I need to heal. And then I, I could heal Barrel this turn. Hmm. Now Barrel needs the experience a little bit more, so we'll do this to Barrel. I also feel like he's the... I mean, long-term viability I am curious about in this game. Because everything does scale so much. Let's see. 19, 19. Let's see, 14. I might be able, can I set this kill up instead? So 22, and that brings you down to 22 minus 36. Seven, that or thirty-seven minus twenty-two. That is fifteen. And his royal. No, he doesn't quite do it. Brent can though. Yeah, Brent can finish this guy off, which is pretty nice. Um, but it'll take some huge damage and then be in range. I think. One, two, three, four, five. Mm, I think he'll just be safe. Well, we'll find out right after this. Let's try it. Ooh, look! Even with the animation stuff, you got to fight the bosses. That's pretty cool. Please dodge this. Weapon triangle. Nice. Cool boss theme. <laughs> okay. Cause yeah, that's not quite enough. And he doesn't have enough. This is Brent. Brent's getting a kill here. Um, no crit. Yeah, he'll live, but this will suck. Okay. <laughs> Female Shaman boss in Chapter 2. No, that's a new one. Brent. Nice one, Brent. All right, let's see what happens here. Level 5. Sick. Very cool. Would love some more speed on him, but that's fine. Got a heal staff. That's nice. Okay, are you safe in that spot? Yes. Heck, yes. All right. All right, now I need to, like, pull... These guys in a bit safely, but I'm gonna take a turn to heal. There's really no good way to pull both these guys in. I'm not gonna do that just yet, so I'm just gonna wait. Let's see, 16. All right, so I think the play here is, let's see, trade, heal. Um, we'll get him up to full. 50 use heal staff though, that's pretty nifty. All right, 
I want her here. Okay, some stats. I do want her here because then this guy gets pulled in. And then I can more safely pull this guy up here. Oh, I can do some cool... Let's see. We'll heal up Barrel. Can Barrel pull this guy? Yes, he can. This guy's got an Iron Bow. We'll start breaking this wall down a little bit. Perfect. Okay. We'll, we'll wait here. I'm playing so slowly and I hate it. But I just respect the enemies so much right here. I have a lot of respect for the enemies. 15-15. And then we can have reliably sprint hit with the javelin. 91. Okay, yeah, that's good. Okay. Because then I can do Brent here with a javelin and then move him up to take on the sword guy. I think that's a good play. And then Royale can go here, do some trading, and then Barrel. Nine. So that's takes him down to. Let's see, is that enough? No. Not quite enough. Okay. So we'll just soften up the wall a little bit, and then Barrel will heal up next turn. Because she can do this, at least. And then this guy should suicide on Barrel, I think. I don't think I pulled anyone in range. Oh, he might be able to go for Raquel now. No. Oh, he went for Amy. That wasn't smart. Okay. But we lived. All right, my mistake. Uh, it's three range shit, man. It's throwing me off. All right, let's heal him up. I'm curious how he does against the Shaman. 22. And what's your res like, bro? Three. He'll live. Still not enough. Holy shit. This is kind of frustrating. Okay. Okay, well, this is going to Royale, I guess. That's fine. Okay. You need to heal. Annie with Devil Axe is definitely going to be my new desperation play, that's for sure. Okay, then... Okay. And now let's see what happens here. Sick. Okay, we did it. Now, I'm going to break down the wall and put Brent to choke. Ooh, that wasn't great. But essential stats for one. All right. These enemy ranges, man. Let's see. So we're gonna heal you up. Yeah, that's fine. We'll use some heals. Conserve some mend. Cause she can survive. Let's see. How much do these guys do? Twenty-three and then twenty-two. Yeah, she's living. So we'll do. We'll break this down with barrel. And then we'll get these guys waiting. Oh, wait, she's not at full health. Shit. Um, heck, 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 heck. Let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so I can just rescue her out of there, actually. Okay, and then Brent. We'll trade this one back and heal him up. All right. Now let's see how this goes. Because these guys might move in. No, they don't move in. Okay. So. Hmm. 
Hmm. Let's see here. Heal her up. Okay. Morgan Brent up here, and let's see what happens. Playing super slowly, and I don't like it. I feel like I'm such a scrub the way I'm playing this, but heck, man, this is lunatic. All right, two nice kills teed up. Good barrel here. Okay. Royal needs a kill. Nice one. All right. Sweet. Okay, that was pretty good. Got a vulnerary. I need that. He's vulnerary man over here. Let's see. How does Brent do? 14. Let's see. So that's 28 plus another 14. Yeah, it's a kill. Perfect. There we go. We're get, we're getting somewhere, guys. We're getting somewhere. It only took us a few tries, but we're getting somewhere. Solid one, Brent. I need some speed on him. Steel sword. That's gonna be nice for Royale. Let's see who's got the chest keys. Royale's got them. So we'll send Amy down because I don't think there's really too much more she can do, honestly. Actually, Flux, 13, 13, okay, yeah, so I think, yeah, we'll do, all right, well, first we'll get Any down here, Steel Bow, that's nifty, okay, so then we'll do a little rescue drop shenanigans here, because this guy's not going to move because he's on the throne, right, so then we can put Barrel here, and first do a little bit of this. I like this. Rescue dropping my archer for wall strats. This is some fun stuff, actually. I actually really like doing stuff like that. And then, nice one. All right, barrel. Door key. Nifty. Uh, what's on the lunatic gem? And then. Okay. Ten ten. 18, 18, with crit. Let's see. Oh, he's got the steel bow. So this goes here. Then we'll do... Yeah, I want to get Royale up there. Who's got the steel sword? You do, okay. Okay, and then 10, 10. Yeah, you live, so let's see how this goes. How did you lock get here so quickly? Those idiots got themselves killed already? Or you won't get past me, scum. I, as I, let's hope nothing stupid happens here. Okay, okay, okay. I can survive another hit, which is nice. I'm just gonna let this dude enemy phase me. Got to, yeah, this is fine. And then that should be like set up. Nice dodge. All right. Okay. 13. Okay, who's going to do 13? That could be Royal or Barrel, probably. Perfect. That's clean. 7. 12. Yeah, let's give this one to Royal. Royal the boss slayer. I'm sure, like, none of these have been posted yet, so I'm sure people are going to be like, why aren't you giving everything to Raquel? Because she could probably use the experience more, but some habits die hard, what can I say? All right, Elixir, cool. Now, who's got the chest keys? Okay, you do. You have one. Yavelin. That's nice. And then, is the other one in the convoy? Let's see. Yes. 
divine. That's nice. Heal up just for some experience. And then we're going to seize, and that's going to be a wrap on Chapter 2. That was fun. I liked that. From this point on, there will be no extra dialogue if some units are alive. This means most of the talking between Beryl and Raquel. I intend to review this in a later release. All right. What is... Oh, Raquel, look at this. Beryl, did you find something? Yeah, look here. This piece of paper was in the leader's room. Seems like the bandits were planning to team up soon. They were going to raid the towns up north. Bandits joining forces? I would have guessed they'd just stick to their own clans. Hmm. Say, Beryl, you remember the shamans that were here, right? I remember they have a, they gave us a hard time. What about them? Normal bandits aren't much for planning and cooperating, but if these shamans manage to talk some sense into them, get them to cooperate to get more loot and gold, then maybe this starts to make a bit more sense. That's a bit of a stretch, don't you think? Maybe. As good a start as any. Given the smarts they've shown so far, I think we, I may be right. Either way, if what the note says is true, then we should move. Even if these bandits are defeated, the others may still attack. Will we just cut through their numbers? Will they still move ahead and go for the raid? There's only so much control the shamans can have. I doubt they could pull back a pack of beasts like them, I suppose. They sure like a good brawl. Besides, even if I'm wrong, the town can give us a lead. It'd be better than traveling nowhere and working off nothing. That's fair reasoning. By the way, Raquel, what will we do with this? This gold is stolen, probably. Shouldn't we return it? I doubt the owners are alive. Or, fair point. So, would we use it ourselves? We make better use of it. There's more bands here than we expected. We'll need this for weapons. It'll make do, I guess. They're using things from dead people. We'll put it to good use. I'm sure the victims would be happy to be avenged. That'll have to be enough comfort for now. But we have to get moving. If I'm not mistaken, the people are at risk. We move with haste. 5,000 gold. All right. That was chapter two. So, we got through it. Um, I'm happy that I was able to power through that after a couple of failed first tries. I got really lucky there with Amy dodging that 60 percenter at that point. That was really lucky. That saved me a, a reset. Um, fun little chapter. I like, I simultaneously like and don't like the way the enemies charge you. I like that it pressures you to like have to, you know, you're kind of, you're supposed to be charging in, but they're like really coming at you to defend, which I feel like is not something you normally see. Usually the enemies just kind of wait for you and then it kind of gives the player opportunities to pick them off one by one. Like, no, you have to act. And it definitely makes you want to use Canto Plus to reposition and figure out the right places to go, which was fun to figure out. Raquel is really good to use. I like the, you know, the dichotomy, I guess, is the word I'd hear between the two tomes where you have one where you can just one round pretty much anything at this point in the game, or you can set up some kills for others to give them more experience. I might need to start ramping up my use of Raquel even more on the killing front. She has, she's only gotten one level so far. I feel like I need to be giving her a little bit more love. Not sure how much I should be investing into these other guys just yet. I mean, everyone's leveling up pretty well, but all the growths in this game are really good. So I'm hoping that there's no, like, you know, I'm sure there is optimal and less optimal choices, but right now I still need everyone to do their job, so I'm not super worried about it. It's still really early. I haven't invested that much overall experience into each of these folks just yet. Um, yeah, it was a fun little chapter. The map was tight. It was small. It was good. The breakable walls made some variations on multiple paths. Um, I played really carefully, though. You have to play so carefully here. I'm sure there's like a faster type of way you can go about doing this, a bit more recklessly. It probably involves using Raquel a lot more liberally than I am. But hopefully I'll be able to start going a little bit faster as my units get better, but we'll see. I have a feeling that this game is going to try and stay neck and neck with me throughout most of it. So um, we'll see how things go. But that was Chapter 2. A kind of home. This is Fire Emblem Souls in the Forest, the hack by Scryza of Fire Emblem 8. I'm your host, Pondon, and I'm looking forward to seeing you guys next time for Chapter 3, Whisperers. Until then, see ya.